the 22-year-old nursing student in Georgia who was barbarically murdered by an illegal alien animal. Uh, the Democrats say, please don't call them animals. They're humans. I said, no, they're not humans. They're not humans. They're animals. And Nancy Pelosi told me that. She said, please don't use the word animal, sir, when you're talking about these people. I said, I'll use the word animal because that's what they are. The fact that Trump is going to be pushing what you just heard him talking. He wants to continue to demonize immigrants. He wants to continue to try to argue to Americans, these brown folks, they are the real reasons for your problems. But when he says these are these immigrants are animals, they're not humans, what does that su suggest? I mean, isn't that brutal? Shouldn't people be condemning that? Except Trump obviously wasn't talking about illegal immigrants broadly, or definitely not black and brown people at all. And believe it or not, these people are lying to you. Again, here we go again with the Democrats and their state media mouthpieces apparently feeling pretty desperate right now because they've now joined the Biden regime in blatantly misrepresenting Trump's words by deceptively editing video of his speech yesterday. Exactly like they did just a couple weeks ago with the bloodbath thing. Check this out and let me know what you think in the comments. But when he says these are these immigrants are animals, they're not humans. The 22-year-old nursing student in Georgia who was barbarically murdered by an illegal alien animal. But when he says these are these immigrants barbarically murdered by an illegal alien animal are animals, they're not humans. What does that su suggest? I mean, isn't that brutal? Shouldn't people be condemning that? I listened to the entire tape. He was specifically talking about the person who murdered Lakin Riley in Georgia. And to be honest with you, Wolf, if somebody murders another human being, I think they deserve to be called animals. And I don't think any American uh, is really going to reject that kind of rhetoric. That poor girl was murdered in cold blood. Is that person who did it not an animal? I think that's an apt term. So you think he was only referring to those murderers, not referring in general to illegal immigrants who are coming into the United States? Barbarically murdered by an illegal alien animal. By an illegal alien animal. By an illegal alien animal. So you think he was only referring to those murderers, not referring in general to illegal immigrants who are coming into the United States? What are you, f***ing stupid? It's so unreal. But you have to realize that these people are operating on their proper propagandized narrative that Donald Trump is a threat to democracy as they lie and deceive the American public. Like I've told you for the last 10 years or more, these people can rationalize literally any action to achieve their goals. They have been using this tired and blatantly obvious tactic for a while now. Going back to when Trump was president, mischaracterizing the things he said like the very fine people hoax. That's been long debunked, but they continue spreading to this day. And we saw them trot out this tactic a couple weeks ago with the bloodbath comment. They even tried this exact thing back when Trump called MS-13 gang members animals by purposely editing out the question that he received about MS-13 and claiming that he was just talking about immigrants. One of the examples that I used to show that the media keeps purposely misrepresenting what Trump said was a year ago when they claimed he called immigrants animals when he was actually talking about MS-13 gangs. We have people coming into the country or trying to come in. We're stopping a lot of them. But we're taking people out of the country. You wouldn't believe how bad these people are. These aren't people. These are animals. And we're taking them out of the country at a level and at a rate that's never happened before. Now here's the part of the clip that our so-called free press is purposely hiding from you. Also, take a look at how CBS News titled this clip. It's downright Orwellian. We'll take care of it, Margaret. Thank you. Why would we'll, there we'll be an MS-13 gang member I know about? If they don't reach a certain threshold, I cannot tell ICE about them. We have people coming into the country or trying to come in. We're stopping a lot of them. But we're taking people out of the country. You wouldn't believe how bad these people are. These aren't people. These are animals. Something very familiar about all this. Don't get me wrong, Donald Trump is not the most eloquent man sometimes, but he doesn't mean the things that the state media claims. In fact, I think Trump is trolling these people at this point, because once they blatantly lie about something he said, the people can go and just see the full clip for themselves, thereby further damaging the credibility of the Democrat state media. An increasingly small amount of people, mostly Democrats, trust the media at this point. So Trump is tricking them into destroying themselves. Anyway, this is just a short one I wanted to quickly get out so that people are ready for the media's propaganda onslaught. It would really help if you shared, hit that like button, and leave a comment to let us all know what you think. Thanks a lot for watching, and I'll catch you all on the next one.